and and he does a great job with his uh, with his barbecue show. Like he you knows watch what it. he's doing. Oh yeah. You know what? And you pick little little uh, tips up. Like I used to be when I would barbecue uh, or cook anything really, but especially mm -hmm. barbecue like steaks or burgers or chicken, whatever. And I take it off, and it'd be like, okay, let's go, let's eat, and away we go. Well, now after watching his show, I you know do the tin foil, I let it sit for a little bit. Oh, the, yeah. just, the radiant heat. Oh, you got to use the. You know what I learned it's from It's so him? much better. I learned from his show is so good. Putting cheese inside your hamburger, like oh, when you're yeah. rolling it up into a oh, patty, you fill it with geez. mozza cheese. Mm -hmm. Oh man, was it good! Yeah, he's uh, he is the uh, the barbecue king mm -hmm. for sure. Then Wally brought something up that I forgot about, but I saw this on uh, on TV. Was uh, Matt Dunigan, uh, former CFL quarterback, he's rated one of the top 50 CFL players of all time, mm -hmm. uh, was a coach, uh, did the uh, analyst thing on TV as well. Still does. Yeah, yeah. And he's got a cooking show now, this uh, Road Grill barbecue thing. I've never thing. seen that. It's absolutely ridiculous. Yeah? Because if you've seen License to Grill with Mr. Rainford, and you watch this Road Grill with Matt Dunigan, it's mm -hmm. the exact same thing. Hmm. And I'm talking from how he cooks his meals to the commentary that he feeds the camera. It sounds exactly the same. And I he's mean, a football guy. And he's a football. Like, you know what? When I'm watching you on TSN and, and you know, and I'm watching you talk about, oh, he should have gone to the deep pocket, blah, blah, blah. I mean, to me, that makes sense from a credible guy. Mm -hmm. And then to me, to have this show on, it's just like, well, I guess anybody can have a cooking show. See, I love shows like this because it's making men, like, want to cook. Sure it is, it's yeah. It's losing that stereotype that it's just well, the but I think domain. And a lot of men are really good at it. Isn't See, it funny, though? I think the thing is, though, with men in the kitchen, it's kind of like, nah. But when you get them on a barbecue. You no, know, we need barbecue. a show to teach men to do dishes and stuff. Yeah, that ain't going to happen. No. <laughs> With Matt Dunnigan, I, I wondered, though, I mean, he could be one of these guys who, uh, you know, at home has cooked and cooked and cooked. Mm -hmm. He apparently on a dare from his family, he auditioned for the position as host back in like 2006. And then when the show finally went to air, he got the gig. And now he's doing cookbooks from recipes from the cookbooks. show. Yeah. He, Matt Dunnigan. But, it's uh, weird. But, I mean, he Maybe might be one of these. He might be a closet cooker. Well, these cooking Maybe. shows, too, they've evolved so much. They're so different. Remember, um, sure. like, the Urban Peasant, wasn't it? He oh, was yeah. always oh, liquored yeah. up yeah. while he was cooking. And <laughs> I used to love that show. Julia Childs with that voice. <laughs> oh, yeah. man. You know who I can't stand, though, is uh, what's that little that little chick's name? Oh, I just lost it. Oh, um, uh, Dark hair. She's cute, but annoying is all. Oh, Rachel now. Ray? Rachel oh, Ray. Oh, she drives me nuts. I wish she'd just crawl oh, into an oven. Oh, and slap her with a steak. <laughs> <laughs> With a wooden spoon. <laughs> Man. Bop it uh, on it's head. amazing, Nobody's though. Nobody's that happy to be cooking. We have a full channel on the on the Food Network, and you bring up a name of a show. Like, they have become personalities. And mm -hmm. uh, you'll find that you'll sit there for an hour on a Saturday or Sunday and watch the cooking shows. Yeah. So, yeah, they've taken on a life of their own. So I, I, we're, we're working on something uh, behind the scenes here. Uh, we want to try some kind of cooking thing. That would be get fun. Yeah. Our friend Renee here from ZTV to shoot it and oh. see how it turns out. Mm -hmm. <laughs>